All right, now we're doing free code camp, new responsive web design, learn typography by building a nutrition label, step 53. So after our last divider, we're gonna create a new P element with the text cholesterol 0mg 0%. We're gonna wrap the cholesterol in a span element and give that span element the class attribute set to bold. All right, then we're gonna wrap the text 0% in another span element with the class set to bold, all right? And then finally, we're gonna nest the cholesterol and zero MG span elements inside an additional span element for alignment. Okay, so another one of these. Uh, so first, we're gonna create a new P element after the last divider, all right? So let's get that going. P right here, close it off with a slash P like that. All right, wrap the text cholesterol, no, 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 no. And then element with the text cholesterol 0mg, we'll just take it. Copy it. And where are we? Right down here. All right. There, we got that. So now we're going to wrap the text cholesterol in a span element and give that span element the class attribute set to bold. Okay. Cholesterol. Wrap it in a span. Span. After cholesterol. Another span slash span all right and then after the first span we're going to say class equals bold all right now we got a bold cholesterol over here uh and okay where were we set to bold okay now we're going to wrap the text zero percent in a span element with the class set to bold okay so we're going to do the same thing so we'll just come over here take this Copy it, 0% right here, 0%, yes. And then after the 0% slash span. All right, now we got a bold 0%. Now we're going to nest the cholesterol and the 0mg span elements inside an additional span element for alignment. So this one and this one. So this one and this one will come right here in the front, in front of that span and say span like this, and after the zero MG, we'll do another slash span. All right, so now it looks like this. All right, good. Uh, let's check it. Looks good, and submit it. All right, now we're on to step 54, and we'll see you next time.